Today's video is going to be a bit different. We're going to be reacting to this video. It's called The Fall of Deuteran Empire, a world box film. Made by Road Goat. All of the credit goes to Road Goat, and make sure you go subscribe to him. This video is brought to my attention by the official World Box Discord, and they literally announced it in their announcements channel. Massive said, Today we want to put a spotlight on an exceptional World Box documentary created by at Road Goat. And I watched like the first 30 minutes of it, and I was like, oh, The link for this video will be in the description, and here we go. Alright, so we're starting off here with the pretty sketchy looking battle. An Emperor's worst nightmare is underway as hundreds of enemy soldiers burn down his cities and slaughter his people. Okay, so right off the bat, pretty intense. His legacy now tied with their deaths, and all he can do is watch from his balcony. Oh, okay, so we're being thrown right into here. An emperor died. Or something. <laughs> Fear uh. and death. Strength and control. This is the way of life on the islands of the Terran Empire. Chapter 1, End of an Era. What? Far from any larger landmass. The okay, so, this is super cool already. Cause, so, it's like, he's setting us up into a world, and he's acting like if it has um, a deep history, and... Oh, this just makes me excited. These islands travel alone. These are Traditionally ooh. trading and now united under one imperial leader. Just south of the main island is Arova. Arova. A people scarred from war, forced to comply with the empire. To the north Ooh. is Yaris, Yaris, a loyal island run by an oppressive leader who feeds off his poor, a common marker of the Deuterans. That's sick, good use of the statue. The center of wars between the capital of Avisa and the province of Modubi is the Emperor's Palace. Oh, spit. The beating heart of a system that is now being passed down to young Valeran, the only child of the man who built the Deterran Empire. Oh, snap, that's These cool. These islands are now his, and the people look up to him for guidance. His legacy has now begun. Oh, snap. In years, many okay, so this guy's legacy just begun. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> so it seems like he's under control of all the three islands, which seems to almost be the first time that they've been united. So let's see where this is going. Many of the poor citizens of the Empire found themselves stuck Chapter in poverty. Chapter 2, the Arova Alliance. Emperor Valerian and his wealthier friends from Yaris would enjoy large feasts as greed quietly festered in the streets. Ooh. The largest province on the Moors, Moduvi, was under control of Alari, cousin to the Emperor. Like Ooh. most of his people, he was loyal to the old Emperor and despised watching his immature son flail around with such power. So he said cousin to the, the Emperor. I don't know how he knows that. There's no family tree in World Box, but for the story purposes, that's amazing. Under the cover of darkness, Ooh. fights broke out in the southern provinces of Moors. The people had enough of the sickness and filth. Okay. And night after night, they grew their movement. Oh, spit. It's a revolution. Oh, this is awesome. He's got a mine! Or dynamite. Oh. Emperor Valeran took no interest in confronting these issues. Wow. Choosing instead to wait out the protests. Meanwhile, the protests. Those Mugubi are just protests. To Irova, an island dripping with hate for the Empire. He struck a secret deal with the leaders of Irova oh, to set snap. their island free in exchange for soldiers to topple Valeran's empire. The Irovan alliance was formed, and hundreds of people boarded ships to attack Moors. Hundreds of ships? numbers, Alari charged into the surrounding provinces, defeating Valeran's army in every town. The protests in the southern provinces evolved into full rebellions. The war rattled the entire island. He's Nobody losing control. But when Alari's men broke into the Emperor's palace, Valeran was gone. This is so cool. So he's using like awesome animations and stuff to go along with it. How do you even make that? <laughs> what? He just showed like two guys walking into a room, going to try and find the Emperor. Oh, okay. Chapter 3. The Coast of- Oh, The Cost of War. The war was much more destructive than anyone anticipated. 
and the power vacuum left loyal citizens of the Empire at the mercy of enemy soldiers. The children! <laughs> Over the coming weeks, squads erased any remaining loyalists, leaving Whoa. nothing but a charred landscape and abandoned buildings. Wow. When the attack began, a panicked Emperor Valeran fled to Yaris where he immediately took command of the island by having his men execute the leader on failure to defend Morris from attack. Whoa! The rest of Yaris and the remaining Imperial soldiers dug in for a final fight. Few of the soldiers that left Erova to fight with Alarai came back. Trust in the Erovan alliance soured overnight. Oh yeah, quickly it would. Erova fell into a deadly civil war. Oh man, everywhere this guy goes, he just brings destruction. <laughs> okay, so so far, so so far there's been a an emperor. He it was the first time that all those islands were united. Then quickly protests began and everything's collapsing. And then he escaped to one of the other islands, which now is also imploding because he just killed their leader. <laughs> Weeks later, Alarai's remaining troops chased the former Emperor Chapter to four. Yaris, where they vowed to destroy the last remnants of the Empire. Brought on three ships? How does he even get that many soldiers? At the castle, Alarai chose to kill his cousin himself, but Valerian had one last trick up his sleeve. Oh! Did he just suicide bomb? The death of old rulers left room for new opportunities. Whoa, chapter 5, a new beginning. To heal. To grow. Oh, was the child. And to build civilization anew, ensuring every citizen gets their fair share. Wow, sounds like communism. <laughs> to mourn the people and the places that have been lost. Plant the seeds that will feed generations to come. This time things will be different. That's so cool. Created by Road Goat. Definitely go, for sure, go subscribe to that guy. Music by, oh, hope this doesn't get copyrighted. Whatever, I'll post it even if it does. Game by Maxime Karpenko. Sorry if I pronounced that wrong, Maxime. That's so cool. Well, that video was awesome. Definitely go check out Road Goat's channel. I would love to make videos like that in the future, but oh man. <laughs> That's really in-depth. Let me know if you'd want to see me do more reaction stuff kind of like this. And yeah.